Hi guys, uh, packing uh, an order here. Uh, this was a custom. Uh, I'm adding the vinyl. Um, she's a paparazzi person, um, and so that's what the papa trips are. Um, it's for her convention and business trips that she does. I'm adding uh, little budget slips to each one of these. And here I was really struggling with that piece of transfer tape. Uh, I was really having a hard time with it, so I had to get a new one. And then there was something wrong with that. I, I got a weak spot in the roll or something because it ended up ripping like three times. Um, and then it wasn't sticking very well. So after I got done with the vacations one and it ripped another piece off, uh, and I noticed it, and I was like, I'm done. New piece. So it's what you see me looking, trying to figure out where it is. There it goes. And I just threw it away at that point and got a new piece and started again. Sorry about my crazy flyaway hair. I didn't really do anything with it. House fund. They're trying to buy a house and stock up on a down payment for that. So I thought that was a great one to have. And so I added the $1,000 bill place marker to it because I'm hoping that they will be able to use that um, and get start getting that much in there. Using a hole punch, getting them all punched correctly. I'm taking an alcohol wipe and I wipe down all the corners because I use a ballpoint pen and scissors to cut all my corners currently and so the alcohol just takes off any of the pen markings. Uh, brand new binder, stretch the spine a little bit, uh, pull, put all the new ones in it, flip through, make sure everything turns correctly, get it put back in the bag so it's nice and neat and stays clean for her. Uh, and then she wanted a 12-month one so she could get receipts and anything like that in it. And this binder will hold the 12, but it holds the six months worth better. Um, so I put six in it and set six aside. Um, my new thank you stickers. Thank you for shopping my small business. Get that sealed up. Put a little piece of packing tape on it because I want it to get there in one piece. So here I've got another order, uh, just more vinyl going on them. This is an upgraded version because there are several different fonts that were used, uh, so they paid more for this one, and at the end the last one is pretty cool. Savings, always I kind of like to throw in that $1,000 placeholder just because hoping that you're going to get that much in savings to be able to use that. Gotta get a new piece of uh, transfer tape. That one had worn out. And if you notice this one and the next one that you can see are similar prints. Um, this is for a couple of sisters. So I thought it would be fun for them to have something similar yet different. And I'm doing the reverse uh, pull off there just because I couldn't get it to come off any better. Sorry about shaking the table. That's kind of the only way I can do it.
I've done a couple of travels now with that travel and vacation with that same Hawaiian looking print. And I, the eye didn't stick to the transfer tape, so I had to reattach it. And I hate to say it, I've done it enough times to where I can reposition it pretty easily. Okay, now this one is one of the super, one of the upgraded versions. Um, black lettering on the black doesn't work. Um, but for up the upgraded price, you can actually have it shadowed. And I did it both ways here. First, where you can see where I layer it. I'm sorry, uh, there was a hair that I had to get out. Uh, but I, I can layer it first. And then the other way I can do it is this way, where I place each layer individually. And the house fund, of course, gets another little thousand dollar placeholder. Um, this was a again a custom order. She had the she wanted the green book. Uh, checking to make sure they'll turn good. I slide it back in the little plastic it came in just to make it a little more sanitary. Clean it up. There it goes. Bye bye.